Soin. I am Cha Bunny from Gochang, Gyeongsangnam-do. Have you ever been to the temple of the Buddha land? Where was that? Gyeongju? Alright, it is in Gyeongju, Gyeongsangbuk-do. It is well known as Bulguksa. Yes, we would like you to take a tour of Bulguksa with us. Are you ready? Yes! <laughs> Over hundreds of years, Buddhism influenced our ancestors' daily lives in the region. Buddhism is still in pressure today. Through this temple, we can see clearly what Korean Buddhism was and is. Let's talk about the history of Bulguksa. Bulguksa was originally built in AD 528 in a period of United Silla. The original Bulguksa was designed by the legendary architect Kim Tae-sung. Bulguksa was a memorial for his parents on the basis of his belief in Buddha. His devotion to his mother ended up being an emotional monument for all of Silla people. Unfortunately, its original architecture was not preserved as it used to be. The temple was destroyed in the middle of 1500s by Dochomi Hideyoshi invasions. The wooden building burned to the ground. Later on, it was partially reconstructed during the Japanese occupation of Korea, but was fully restored during the later years of the 20th century. However, we lost many treasures that we cannot witness the original beauty of Bulguksa. These scriptures are must across the river and go through the clouds to the Buddha lands, named Ilzumu and Chonangmu. Through these two gates, one can go to high mountains leading to the Buddha land. There is an old saying that every minded person can't go through Chonangmu. So, are you innocent enough to walk through Chonangmu? <laughs> also, we live to lead you in the Buddha world. Those are designated as Korean national treasures. As one goes to into Bulguksa, a semicircular is next to the bridge will be seen. When it rains, a rainbow will be there if it is a lucky day. It is amazing that our ancestor built this taku using the 1,200 years ago. Isn't that wonderful? More interesting point is that architect at the time apply great technique against possible earthquake. This beauty comes from the science. Yes, color of Bulguk style. It is an emphasis style which also can be seen in Greek shrine in Athens. The pillar leads us to appreciate its beauty of science. The pillar is thicker in the middle, but the other two ends gradually become narrower. This unique style suffered heavy Korean looping tiles. Now, you finally enter the temple of Buddha land Bulguksa. There are two pagodas on the temple site. The Pabuta and Sopata are the two of the most valued pagodas in Korea. The Bulguksa is the grand centerpiece of religious architectural complex of exceptional significance. So, you will never be disappointed with tour to Bulguksa. Thanks for your listening.